What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Hoffixie and welcome back today to Hello Neighbor! How are we doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back! Today it is time to check out a brand new Hello Neighbor custom map slash mod thingamajig. Today we are going to be checking out one called Basement Hatred. And apparently, according to the guy who made this, this is actually quite a hard one. So I'm intrigued, I'm intrigued. We know our way around Hello Neighbor pretty well. So I'm excited for the challenge. Um, but yeah, so in case you don't know what this is and you're super, super confused right now, basically, currently, uh, Tiny Build, they're running this, like, Hello Neighbor official modding contest. You can, like, download this crazy mod kit through uh, Unreal Engine and there's, like, cash prizes. Like, the top prize is $5,000, which is amazing. <laughs> um, but yeah, so the cool thing is when you submit your mod, you could actually, like, uh, people can play them as well. And yeah, we're going to be checking out one today. So let's get started. Wow, doesn't that look so cool? The burning mannequin of justice. Oh my goodness me. Okay, so what are we doing here? I have no idea. Um, What do we got? We got a thing full of baseballs. Should we take a baseball? Why not? Um, Do these, do these pictures do anything? Can I remove the pictures? I trust no pictures. <laughs> because it like, like, remember the, um, the, uh, uh, what was it? The, 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 the picture puzzle thing in like the, the, latest Hello Neighbor ones, uh, with the stuff behind them, and you can turn them, and all that good stuff. Never trust a picture! That's what I've learned. I'm gonna go and check that picture out. So I think, from what it seems- Oh, I nearly fell off the map. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I think we need to get up here, so let's do a little bit of hardcore parkour! And oh, Damn. Can I actually just reach the picture the normal way? The old-fashioned way? Can I remove this pot? This, this vase? Get out of here, vase! Alright, let me try that one again. So let me go up here. Come on. Okay, good. Oh no. Dos! Dos! Ah, oh, failed on dos. <laughs> this is the opening start of the map. This is this is not ideal if we're failing on the parkour section. I mean these shelves are so tight. Ah, there we go. Okay, there we go. Now we're on a roll. Anything? No, nope, just a picture. Okay, and an umbrella! Oh, I missed it. Can I just get it from here? Hey! Okay, so I can get it from here. Um oh! Oh, okay, now I see. So we needed the umbrella to get down here without dying. Clever. Clever, I get it. Okay, so here we go, here we go, here we go. And woohoo! Big white door. But what is behind the big white door? Whoop. Oh, wow. Whoa! <laughs> oh, okay, so apparently there are jump scares in this one, which is always good news. He said lying. All right, okay, there we go. Um, So I don't know if we need the umbrella, but we just put our stuff down here for now. Okay, 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 so where should we go first? Um, we've got a cupboard in the middle of nowhere, which is kind of doing nothing in particular. What's in here? Uh, okay, so we've got some milk. Got a drawer. Oh, there's another baseball. Why are there so many baseballs everywhere? Maybe that's part of the puzzle. We've got some... Ooh! Ooh! Lever! Flick it! Can I flick it? Come on! Come on! Behave! Yes, I can! Hey! Okay, so that's pretty good news. Alright. Um, oh. What have we got over here? We've got like a bed area. What's in there? Oh, we got sleeping pills. Oh! So I'll tell you what we can do now, because we've got the milk and the sleeping pills. Ta-da! <laughs> we can make glowing milk. I don't know if that's good for anything, but this might be part of the puzzle. I have no idea. Okay, let's go and check out some more. So, oh. Oh, look. Oh! <laughs> Please don't screw at me again. No, okay, it's not going to do it. Okay, so we've got the green key door. Right, okay. So, we do we need to find the green key? And, oh. Oh, there's another locked door. Right, Okay. We've got another burning pile of mannequins. Wow, that looks so cool. <laughs> Doesn't that look mad? It's like super, super creepy, but... Wow. That would make a really good thumbnail. Okay, um, so what have we got here? We've got a little bathroom area as well. The taps work. Okay, interesting. And then if we walk around here, we've got a big pile of boxes and a skateboard. Right. So we need to find some keys. That would be the thing. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's a key. It's a key. I see a key. I see a key. Oh, no. It's all the way up there. Are you kidding me? 
Oh, I, I've got it. I've got it. We need to make a box pile. Oh, I hate this. So, like... They've kind of done away with it in the more recent versions of Hello Neighbors, and there's a reason for it. It's because, like, people were like, using the boxes to get to areas where they shouldn't do, although technically, because we all have, like, the access to the cheat trainers now, we can kind of just go there anyway. But uh, especially at the beginning, like, people actually thought that the, a part of the actual game was to use the boxes to get to places, when in reality, that just isn't true. There is, like, always an alternative way which shouldn't have to use boxes in order to get there. So they kind of, like, toned down on the boxes in the actual games, and they sort of got rid of most of them because they didn't want people to like think it was part of the game um but the only problem is is that now we have to use them for this and i hate piling up boxes i remember there was one part of the game i can't remember which one it was but i just i was convinced i was like yes we're definitely gonna have to use boxes in order to get here apparently that wasn't the case but i spent like an oh i spent like an hour piling up boxes the problem is you think you think you're friends with the box and then all of a sudden it just goes and betrays you <laughs> Something weird will happen. Some shenanigans will happen. It will just start to randomly just just fire out and break and fall over and oh. All right, okay, steady, steady does it. Okay, that's good. That's good. Is that a key? Yeah, it is a key. <laughs> we got the key. <laughs> awesome. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so this key should open what? This door? Yes. And what's in here? It's a It's a baseball. Okay. It's a baseball. We have thousands of baseballs already. What? Is that already all that there's in here? I mean, it looks like a really weird, like, sacrifice-style room. But I've probably been playing a lot of Bendy and the Ink Machine, so that's the reason why. Um. Okay. What's the relevance of the baseballs, then? Because we've got loads of them. Hmm. I don't know. Um... Do we throw them up to stuff? Like, ha! Huh. Can we? Is it okay? What? what, what, what? Can we pick this one up. Oh! Ooh! Did you hear that? It's opening something behind here. Oh my goodness! So are this? I, I knew it was the pictures. It's always the pictures, man. <laughs> the pictures always do something. Um. So is that unlocked itself? No, no, we need the green key. Where's the green key? Are there any more pictures? It's always the pictures. The pictures are the most guilty. Oh, there's one here. Pictures. <laughs> oh, the pictures are the best place to hide stuff, man. Okay, there we go. Green key. Yeah. Okay, okay. So we can open this door now. Boom. Nice. All right. Ooh. What on earth is going on in here? Okay, so there's a second closed area. Oh, and now I understand the baseballs. Oh, no, don't pick up the crate. Pick up the baseballs. <laughs> we need to make the shot. Like that. Yeah. Oh, it's a huge one. That looks so cool. So has that opened this up? Yeah, it has. Okay, awesome. All right, so we've got, well, we've got a magnet gun here. There's... Oh, no, no, don't throw the magnet gun, James. What do you do? Oh, I've crashed the game. Oh, I've crashed the game. I'm going to have to start from the beginning. <laughs> no. Yeah, for, I, I don't know why. For some reason, every now and again, um, especially with these Hello Neighbor mods, when you try and use, like, the power throw, it's, um, it just, like, crashes my game. I'm not sure why. I have no idea. Um, but what I was thinking was, do we have to even get that other key? Because we opened it and nothing really happened, did it? So, oh, I forgot about the jump scare. <laughs> I thought we'd just power back through to where we got up to so hopefully this doesn't crash like it shouldn't yeah there we go maybe it's just throwing the magnet gun so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna throw the magnet gun this time i wanted to see what was in here first see it's it's a key but it's hot do you see that the key is hot oh but i can't pick it up oh do i run it under the tap i may have just had i may have just cracked the case here lads Look at this. So if I put it in the bath. Come on, get in the bath. Yes. And I run the water. Do you think it cools down the key? Or can I just pick it up? Oh, I can just pick it up. Are you kidding? <laughs> I thought I thought that was so clever. 
No! Are you kidding me? Oh god, where am I? Okay, let's go through here. Alright, okay, okay. So we've just got like... Okay, there's a second gate here. I don't know if we're necessarily supposed to get out of it. I love the glowing effect on the keys and the locks. That looks awesome. Alright. Boom. Oh, that raises this, does it? Wow. Okay, so I need to, I need to get my umbrella back, basically. I need to use my umbrella that we got at the beginning. Um, so I'm wondering, like, was the, um... Was the second key, that one up there, was it just a troll? <laughs> was it just to make people do box towers? Because everyone hates doing box towers. <laughs> I kind of feel like it maybe was. If that's the case, that's genius. That's, that's not just genius, that's evil genius. All right, nothing in these drawers. Okay, okay, okay. So let's go down here. And let's float down and see what's cracking. Hopefully we haven't... Oh! What the heck, man? <laughs> We've got the neighbor crying, surrounded by fiery mannequins. Oh, and that's it! <laughs> okay, so that, that wasn't like a super long mod, but that was a really good one. That was a really good one. The puzzles are really good. I love the fact that they had like stuff hidden behind pictures. Um, yeah, oh, I wasn't expecting that to be the end. That was such a weird end. I don't know if it has, like, a story. I think they were just trying to make, like, an escape-style puzzle room. And I think that's a really, really good thing to do in Hello Neighbor. I enjoyed that a lot. So, uh, yeah, there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, please remember to poke me in that like button. And if you're not yet subscribed, go for it, because we do Hello Neighbor done fun. But until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Rancy up!